Hey everyone, I'm Aaron Hoskins and I am sitting in front of the Baby Lock Destiny 2. I'm going to show you how to take a JPEG line image and convert that into an applique complete with satin stitching. I have a USB stick plugged into the side of my machine. I have gone online and found the image that I wish to use. So that's where I'm going to tell the machine to search for the image. So first I'm going to touch IQ Designer and bring in my image. So here is my image. I'm going to apply some line settings first. So I'm going to apply double stitch, change the color to red, and then touch create line image. Now my image is red and I know that the double line property is applied. This will be my placement stitch. I touch next. In this screen, I have a link icon. I want to link all three images together. That way I'm sure to export the design in its entirety. Now I'm gonna save it and proceed to embroidery. So I'm creating an applique. So what I want to do is add another line or add another design on top of this. See we have our placement stitch, then we want our tack down stitch, then we want our satin stitch. So I'm going to touch edit and duplicate. Now you'll notice that everything looks kind of disarrayed here on the screen. So what I want to do is I want to pull that design down, touch my original image, touch move, and center. That's going to center that image up, but that's going to make it easier to center my second image on. So I touch my second image and touch center. And now both of my lines overlap or overlay on top of one another. So I touch OK. Now we're ready to add our satin stitching. So I touch add, go back to IQ Designer. At the bottom of the screen, there are two folders, one with a red arrow pointing in and one with a blue arrow pointing out. That's the icon we want to choose because we want to pull our saved design out of that pocket. There's my design. I touch set. Now I want to apply a satin stitch to this line property. So I touch my line properties menu. Satin stitch is selected by default. I'm going to change the color to green just so that I can see it. I touch my line properties paint pot so that I apply the green satin stitch to the seaweed. I touch next and then I select the link key so that whenever I change any settings it applies to the whole design. Now that I have the whole design selected I know from experience that I want to increase the width of the satin stitch. To do that, I touch this icon here, and again, from experience, I know that a satin stitch width of 0 0.140 works well. I touch set, and preview. That came out nice. So now I touch set, and OK. Now you'll notice that um, the red line design that I had previously on my screen shows up behind the green satin stitching. We don't want that. So to change that, we touch edit, move, and the center icon and everything lines up perfectly. Now I touch OK, embroidery, and now I have everything set up. I have my placement stitch, my tack down stitch, and my satin stitch.
and that's how you create an applique using the IQ Designer on the BabyLock Destiny 2.